We got on our plane, into our seats, all strapped in. Kathy Monroe finally arriving at Logan Airport after being delayed in Atlanta, stuck on a parked plane for two hours. It was really early. Everybody got up probably around three <laughs> to get there for five to wait. She was one of countless passengers this morning impacted by the FAA's pause of domestic departures. The move made because of an outage to a national system. What happened? Um, <clears throat> That's what we were asking, like, how does something like this happen? A passenger shared this video of a crowded gate at Logan Airport this morning where passengers waited out the ground stoppage. There's no point in trying to change your layovers at this point because even the layovers are delayed. Thousands of flights delayed or canceled, but some passengers only experienced minor delays. I guess if I was impacted more, I might be like a little more irritated about it, but I mean, I'm just okay with them doing the right thing to, to keep all the travelers safe. The halting of flights follows the major disruptions over the holidays due to weather with Southwest Airlines. Aviation experts say consumer confidence will take a hit. You know, we're just at a point now we're coming after COVID. We're seeing airlines flying and setting record passenger levels, which is great. And this does nothing to help the confidence in, in the traveling public as it relates to air travel. Now, between Southwest Airlines and what happened over the holidays and today's stoppage, the one common thread is technology. We'll hear more.